I've got a Framework 13 laptop running Omarky, and when I close the lid, I really want my laptop to disable the laptop monitor, the laptop screen. This makes it so that I only have one monitor available on Omarky, which is the external monitor that I'm docked into. So I'm gonna show you how to set that up today. So the very first thing we wanna do is we're gonna vim into login dconf. There's the path right there. And then the key thing here is that I wanna make sure that handle lid switch docked is set to ignore. And then if you wanna set this up on external power or just general lid switch, um, you probably wanna set these to ignore as well. You definitely don't want them set to suspend because they will suspend your computer. Now that we've done that, we can pull up uh, a script. So I've got a folder here called scripts in my hyper config. So config hyper scripts and lid.sh. Um, this is really straightforward. All we're doing is we're executing a shell script and then uh, we're checking to if there are hyper control monitors. So saying, hey, hyper control, give me the monitors. Checking if DP1, which is my external monitor, is available. And then if we are Passing in the close argument, we want to disable the laptop screen when the lid is closed. And if we pass in the open argument, we want to uh, enable the laptop screen when the lid is open. Almost done, there's just a few steps left. So outside of that, we need to pull up our hyper config, or our hyperland config, I should say. And then we wanna add these two lines down here. So we have new binds that we wanna to bind to. We wanna to bind to uh, switch on lid and switch off lid. So when the lid is uh, on and when it's off. And then you can see over here, we are calling close, and then we have open, to, and we're passing those to our shell script. The last thing you wanna do is do hyper CTL reload, and then that will reload your Hyperland config and make it so when you close your laptop, your monitor on your laptop, the embedded screen will be disabled. Hopefully this helps. If it does, let me know in the comments below. Thanks and have a great day.